Hey guys, it's Ektaku, and today I'm back with another video, and I'll be talking about three do's and don'ts of drawing. So, first, the don'ts. Number one is don't blindly copy the drawing, or you won't learn how to draw without tracing. What I mean by this is like if you always just copy it and every time you draw you just copy an image you won't learn the proper tracing for it so you won't if you try to draw it without tracing it you might find that you're having a hard time drawing the eyes the hair the chin your your placements are all over the place the proportions not right and so that's and you don't want that so that's why you don't want to blindly copy it now for my second don't, this is mostly for people who draw digitally and that is you don't want to draw everything in one layer, especially um, if you're using guidelines and that way you don't have to erase everything when you go back to it, you can just hide the layer. It makes it really efficient, it makes it much more easier for you to draw and yeah, even especially also if you're coloring, if you're including to color. If you use doing the same layer, it's gonna be really messy. So yeah, just keep that in mind. Now for the do's, you first want, you wanna have proper placement. And uh, well, basically you just wanna use guidelines. Uh, I always, I can't stress this enough. You just wanna use guidelines all the time. And uh, otherwise the proportions will be like all janked up or messy. And yeah, guidelines are really helpful. Helps you know all the proper placement now for my second do you want to try to be original whether it's like drawing your own oc or using a reference image try to invent like new poses or uh, new angles uh, just like new styles and then eventually uh, you want to create your own style because that's like the ultimate goal for us artists and so that is my don'ts and do's for drawing and yeah thanks for watching and drop a like and subscribe if you found this helpful and i'll see you in the next video thank you